Hello and welcome back to Inverse Audio. Today I'm bringing you the ultimate guide to this year's Black Friday deals. With so many discounts available, it might be hard to find the right ones. This is definitively the best time of year to be grabbing audio tools and plugins. So if you want to save yourself an extra bit of money, I'd recommend picking them up now rather than later. Some of the companies I'll mention have partnered with me as an affiliate, which means I earn a very small commission if you choose to purchase through my links. So if I could please ask you guys if you are planning to buy any of these plugins, if you could please use my link it doesn't cost you anything extra and it just allows me to keep creating videos for you guys but yeah without any further ado let's get into the deals so starting off, I do want to say that we are having a massive sale on Inverse Audio. We're offering up to 70% off on some of our sample packs. We also have a complete total bundle pack, which is 50% off the initial value. Uh, so if you don't have any of the sample packs, now would be the perfect time. I never really run any sales apart from Black Friday. So if you haven't checked them out, now would be the perfect time. I'm also now running a deal on the one-to-one -one personalized tuition for the first time. So if you've ever wanted uh, some personal time, with me going over your music and really analyzing where we can help you uh, then now would be a great time to do it these deals will be available until the 2nd of december so what are you waiting for go grab them at the link below so I'm first going to start with plugins that I think are absolutely essential for any producer, regardless of what genre you produce. And kicking us off is arguably the GOAT of all EQs, FabFilter Pro-Q3. Pro-Q3 is arguably the best EQ on the market. It features dynamic EQ, it features mid-side EQ, it's clean, it's easy to use. Everything you would want from an EQ. Good for everything from surgical EQs to massive tone shaping it can be dynamic you can side chain into it you can analyze the different clashing frequencies between your different sounds and it is probably my most used plugin i use it at least 10 times a project if not more it is currently 25 percent off so in pounds it's 107 95 it is a pricier plugin but for the quality that you get and how much you use eqs it i in my opinion it's totally worth it uh, along with that the other fab filter deals that are on is pro c2 it's also 25 percent off this is probably my most used and favorite compressor uh, i love the sound of it i love the way that it's just so simple and intuitive and i think it's just super versatile anything from vocals to like bus compression this this compressor can really do it all if you're thinking of picking a few of these up in a bundle there's the fab filter mastering bundle there's the mixing bundle and lastly there's the total bundle with all the plugins um, so just go for whichever one you might want, but they're all 25% off. Fab filter don't really tend to do any more than 25% off. It's quite standard for them. So uh, yeah, if you haven't picked any of those plugins up, now would be a good time. Next up, we have my favorite plugin developers for creative effects, and that would be Sound Toys. So we have the Sound Toys 5.4 Total Bundle coming in at 169, which is the lowest ever price for this bundle, I believe. Um, I mean, the value that you get in this is absolutely crazy. I think it's, tw it's 21 plugins for under £10 a plugin, which for sound toys is absolutely amazing. The quality of these plugins is honestly subpar, and I use all of these in my projects. If you're not going to go for the full bundle, here's a few that I would recommend. So Decapitator, this is another one of my go-tos. It's my favorite analog uh, saturation distortion uh, it's an absolute beast of a plugin and for 40 pounds uh, it, it's actually incredible 75 percent off on this one another one from the sound toys bundle would be little altar boy uh, this is probably a bit more niche but it can do some really really cool stuff to vocals i use this a lot to formant shift them it's probably my go-to formant shifter uh, they also have a, like a drive setting if you want to make things warmer uh, but really really great plugin and lastly tremolator this is really good for getting some rhythm in your tracks it's really good for for things like pads or basses and really do a lot with this one but yeah moving on from sound toys but one of the most simplest yet most effective plugins i think i've ever used potentially would be track spacer now track spacer is a dynamic eq and it's just my go-to tool if the two elements in my tune are clashing put a track spacer on it and it's fixed it's actually incredible what such a simple plugin can do and i'm not really sure what i used to do before i got this plugin uh, but right now as you can see it's 23.95 it is 50 percent off in this black friday sale which is a really good deal now moving on the last of the essential producer plugins that i would 
recommend would be Isotope 11. Isotope 11, I would say, is a one-stop shop when it comes to mastering. It can do everything that you need. I think some of my favorite tools on there is the Imager, the Exciter, the Multiband Compression, and many, many more. I, I use this on every project when it comes to mastering. There's the advanced version that's on sale, uh, as well as the standard version. So just pick whichever one suits your needs. Next, I'm going to go through essential plugins for drum and bass specifically. These are plugins that I almost always use within my drum and bass track. Some of them are a bit more specific um, when it comes to like sound design and things, but all really, really good deals. First of all, we have the Go of Distortions, and that's right, you guessed it, it is Rift 2.0. This plugin, I love it, I abuse it, I use it all the time, and it is 50% off of this Black Friday. Uh, this is the cheapest that I've ever seen it. I wish I got it for this price, and honestly, it's, it's such a steal. It's the best distortion, I think, on the market. Uh, it also has some crazy presets. Some of the craziest presets I've ever seen in a distortion. You can literally press random preset, and it's like you, you're opening a preset in Serum, but instead it's doing it through the distortion. It really is crazy. It's like a preset on top of a preset. <laughs> So yeah, that's why I would have to say it's almost essential for drum and bass. Now, another plugin I love to abuse on my basses is Disperser. It has such a unique sound. It's an all-pass filter. It essentially sounds like a multi-band delay which can make things sound very zappy and very lasery. However, it's not on sale, unfortunately, this Black Friday, as far as I'm aware. However, Multipass is. Now, if you don't know what Multipass, it's the Kilohertz answer to processing. So you can chuck one of these on your mixer, uh, on the instrument, and it's all you need, essentially. It's got all of their bass free effects on there, as well as all of their paid ones. So, for example, Disperser, you can just use it on there, create one band, and that'll be a workaround. It's slightly cheaper than buying Disperser by itself, and you get other amazing modules on there like the shaper table and shaper box which are some of my uh, favorites as well recently really loved using them on my bases and things like that but you can make it for some really really interesting uh, post-processing uh, to take your sounds to that next level and then next to finish off the killer hearts ecosystem we have face plan now if you haven't heard of face plan uh, before it's a really really powerful synth and it's especially used a lot in drum and bass it's definitely the most complicated but most powerful synth uh, out there the fact that you're not limited to certain amounts of oscillators and the fact that it's modular it's a very powerful synth and for 81 pounds i don't think you can go wrong for, for such a great piece of kit and then lastly, uh, I'm going to cover some of the deals that I've found that aren't essential plugins, but they are very cool plugins to have, and I'm sure they will level up your sound. So first of all, we have Shaperbox. Now this is a recent pickup of mine, and it's a creative effects powerhouse, essentially. Been playing about with some of the presets in here, and I am blown away. Uh, you put this on any of your sounds, and the amount of effects in here working at the same time is absolutely crazy. But yeah, Essentially, this plugin can save you a heck of a lot of time with automations. I'd really recommend this if you're trying to get really creative textures and really cool sounds out of your music. And then the other uh, Cable Guys plugin that I would recommend is a new one that they've just released. It's called Snapback. So essentially, Snapback is for layering your drums. You can add in cool little attacks that sort of swoosh up. Um, as well as adding decay. So it's really useful for adding that like extra 10% to your snare, for example. And at 23 pounds, it is a cheaper plugin, but I think definitely a lot of cool possibilities to be explored with this one. I'm gonna use this one a lot on my drums in the near future. Next, we have another creative effects plugin and this being Portal. I would say it's my go-to for creative glitchy uh, shape-shifting effects. I love putting this on pads. I love putting this on plucks. It can really transform a simple sound and make it really complex just with using a few presets. Uh, so definitely uh, check this one out. Next, we have a bundle by Universal Audio. So there's 23 plugins in this bundle for the price of £79. Uh, there's quite a few plugins that I use in here. Some of those being uh, the Century Tube Channel Strip. I love putting this on buses sometimes for an extra bit of compression or EQ. The Galaxy Tape Echo is one of my favorite tape echoes. Um, there's the Moog Minimog, which is an emulation of the old retro synth. Arguably the best thing in this whole package is the Opal Morph Morphing Synth, which you've seen some of my other videos you know I love to use, especially for my intro. I think it's my favorite warm analog type synth emulation. 
it's really great the presets in here are amazing on top of this you get a whole bunch of other plugins you get the pull tape eq the pure plate reverb which i love using as well you get an la2a emulation and many more next we have another really cool creative uh, effect this being motion dimension um, this being uh, 50% off and it's a plugin I picked up earlier this year and I would say it's my favorite creative reverb and delay plugin. You can chuck it on a sound and instantly transform something very simple into something really complex that sounds super professional um, but all you've done is chuck a reverb on it. So if you're looking for a really cool reverb I would say this is the pickup of this season. Next we have Vision 4X which was made uh, in partnership with Noisia so you already know it's going to be great for drum and bass. It is the one-stop shop for visualizers. It features four different sections. It's almost named after me, 5X. It's not actually. But yeah, it offers a spectrograph, it offers a bar graph, a waveform view as well as a phase coloration meter. So it's really great for making sure that everything you attract is sitting where it needs to be and for a price of £49 I I don't think you can really go wrong with this one. Next, we have a really cool uh, reverb that I recently picked up, and that would be Black Hole by Eventide. Now, this one is just a really great reverb that you can put on sounds and literally make them sound like they're in a black hole or in the depths of space. It gives it a lot of space. Uh, it's almost like a, a shimmer. It's really never ending, uh, but it's one of the best reverbs I've heard in a while. Uh, I'm going to keep using this plugin and if you want a really great sounding reverb for making things sound super ambient, I'd say this is the one to go for. Next we've got another staple is Oxford Inflator. Now if you haven't heard of this plugin, it's essentially a tone booster. It's the secret weapon for adding warmth and loudness without sacrificing your dynamics. It's perfect for vocals, synths, maybe even drums as well. It's only £27 in this sale and it's always really, really popular. So if you haven't grabbed it already, uh, I would recommend it. It's a great plugin to use. Uh, and then we have another plugin which is similar to that of Inflator, except it's multiband and also works uh, as an EQ. And that would be Spectre by Waves Factory. This is another plugin i picked up recently and i'm uh, a little bit amazed i love using my master uh, on the low end and it making it sound so thick um, so i would definitely recommend if you're trying to get maybe that extra five to ten percent of thickness uh, in your tracks especially in the low end next up we are moving to the arturia ecosystem beginning with pigments 5 now if you've been watching the channel for a while then you know that i love this plugin it's i'd say it's my go-to for pads for granular synths for leads for plucks i love the presets in here they feel super spacey and just really really high quality it almost always has what i'm looking for and for 82 pound it's probably Probably the best price synth and most powerful synth uh, out there right now so if you ever been looking at this I would recommend getting it now uh, because it's not gonna stay this price and it's a deal that I would want to miss out on that's for sure so if you're interested in uh, the collection as well Arturia have the V collection X at 250 pounds which for the amount of plugins that you get it is a lot of money but for the amount of plugins that you get is actually crazy okay so we have two more uh, synths to finish this video off the first one being current 2.0 now this recently had a free update to current 2.0 i did use current 1.0 it was really good but 2.0 really takes it to the next level now honestly i think this could be a competitor to zero it is that good of a synth the granular engine the the oscillators the wavetables in here is absolutely amazing the filters and not to mention the effects they use the whole minimal audio ecosystem so you have an inbuilt rift into the synth as well as like the flex chorus uh, which i love as well uh, but now that it's in there for 82 pound again like it's such a steal for these synths to be priced at this price point i don't think you can really go wrong uh, so definitely check this one out if you're looking for a really powerful bass synth uh, and then last but not least we have the horizons bundle by waves now if you know me i i love to use waves plugins especially when it comes to vocal mixing i think they have the best plugins out there for that there's a crazy amount of plugins in this bundle but most importantly they have everything in the renaissance collection rds -er, rcom 
Just so many of these great plugins that uh, I use all the time. That our stuff is absolutely amazing. Not to mention they have, for example, the H delay, which is my go-to delay. The price per plugin in this one is also absolutely amazing um, and they're really, really high quality. But yeah, if you plan to buy any of these plugins, then please make sure to use my link. I will also leave a spreadsheet where I will keep updating these deals and maybe fish out a few more for you. Um, so if you want more of these deals or just somewhere to store them for the weekend, then uh, uh, that would be down below. Thanks for sticking around and I wish you a happy Black Friday and I hope that you get all the plugins that you've wanted this season. Anyway, that's all from me. Take care. Peace.